My soldiering days are done. I'm heading to Boston, on foot, to see if my sister survived all this. She's got an apartment on Boylston Street. This is Mike Daly, signing out. Good luck, and God bless America. Or what's left of it. Come on, the BF's gone. Oh! It's a game. Oh, a game in a game. <laughs> October 22nd, okay. <laughs> Some things I've collected I've not had the chance to look at yet so far to check them out. Dad was shouting, telling me I should be ashamed that, that I had to get out of the house. Mom just cried and somehow that hurt worse than anything else. She didn't say a word, not even when I packed my things. I can't go to John. He doesn't even know yet. Maybe he'll never know. If it weren't for the cabin, I, I wouldn't have a place to sleep. Just need some time to think. Last time I was here, I was just a little girl playing clubhouse in this old cabin. Now I'm really scared. Will anything ever be right again? Well, I'm going to hopefully catch your stream next time you're streaming. Okay, thanks for... Um, tuning in and having a good chat with me. I love having chats with people. And I always apologise if I get a bit too angry with the game. It's just, I do when it like, won't go my way. I'll be streaming later on today. I'm looking at starting at um, 11 o'clock UK time, but I might be delayed, I'll just see. I may possibly play more of this, let's just see how I feel. <laughs> Oh yeah, thanks, uh, thanks for tuning in and watching me. I very much appreciate the follow too. Hello, my name is Storytime Simon. Mm, Commander's gone. And I hope you like stories, because I love to tell stories. This one is called The New Squirrel. Come with me on this magical adventure. There once was a young squirrel named Ricky who lived in a big oak tree in a city park. Ricky was a brown squirrel and lived in the oak tree with all his brown squirrel friends and family. Every day, Ricky would look out from the top of his tree and wonder what kind of squirrels lived in other trees. The older squirrels warned Ricky that the squirrels in other trees were thieves and liars. They were never to be trusted. Ricky had a rebellious heart not form his opinions based on anecdotal evidence. End of hollow tape. Please insert hollow tape too.
All right, well, see you later Three today whenever you're on for Eastern Welcome Time Zone. Back. Okay, no worries. And here it is, part two of The New Squirrel. One night, a red squirrel appeared mm. at the bottom of Ricky's oak tree and woke Ricky and his family. Oh, please help me, said the red squirrel. I am lost and have nowhere to go. The elders were quick to turn the red squirrel away, but Ricky scurried down the trunk of his tree and stood firm next to the red squirrel. He yelled up at the elder squirrels. How could you turn him away? Just because he's from another tree? He needs our help. Affected by Ricky's assuredness and determination, the elders agreed to take in the red squirrel. The red squirrel thanked Ricky for standing up for him. You won't regret this, he said. End of holotape. Please insert holotape. Hi, Gus1405. Welcome to my stream. Hi, Oz Dragon. Welcome to my stream, too. Just that one left. Blake, I want you to listen to me as a brother here. This whole deal with Eddie is wicked shisty. I mean, what kind of business partner threatens to kill you if the deal doesn't go his way? We are in way over our heads, man. I can't see a way out of this. No way except shutting down and getting out of Dodge. Give me a chance to talk this out with you face to face. I just want both of us to get out of this. Hmm, that's it then. So, Kellogg wasn't giving us any bull. Your son really is on the inside. Even I don't know where the Institute is. They built it. You don't know anything, Nick? Look at me. I'm trash. They <laughs> threw me in the junk pile ages ago. Just another discarded prototype. Didn't exactly leave me the house keys. We're in the weeds here. Time to take a step back. Bring in some fresh eyes. Only person I know willing to snoop up the Institute's tail feathers is Piper, the reporter in Diamond City. I say we head her way. Talk this through. How could Piper help us? Trust me, that dame knows a lot more than she lets on. And she lets on a lot. But I know <laughs> her. She's done her homework. And we need to talk this through with someone. Diamond City it is. Hey, chin up. I know the night just got darker. Won't last forever. Hmm, we'll see what we can find here now. I've opened the doors. Let's have a see. Rifle. Rifle. Ah, some bullets. Lots of ammo in here. Oh, 
want to sleep on one of these beds. Health back up. Well, thank you very much for the follow, TC316, and welcome to my stream. I got sorted. Uh, wow, well, we've got bullets here. for that. Where is Valentine gone? And a terminal. Where is it? The think you can unlock that terminal? Good plan. Hmm, where's gone? Oh, it's there. Come on, Valentine. I've got a lift to go down. That's it. 